The Minute and a Half Man is a Terry Toons Hector Heathcote cartoon from 1959 that's directed by Dave Tendler and written by Eli Bauer with a voice cast including John Myers. And I think this is my introduction to Hector Heathcote. If I've seen any before, I definitely haven't seen many. And it's okay, it's an interesting premise. Hector Heathcote is a very likeable protagonist, but it's definitely very slow. I'd say the first minute was really strong, and then the rest of it slowed down until maybe the last kind of two minutes. So the pacing isn't amazing, it's not consistent, but it's enjoyable enough that I, I would recommend it. Hector Heathcote has joined the Minutemen. This is during the American Revolution. Unfortunately, he's not really good at being a Minuteman. Minutemen were so-called because they were able to get ready for action within a minute as it goes. And throughout the cartoon, we see Hector Heathcote, to his credit, trying to get better at that. And I think he's a very positive character. He's very likable. He has this problem and he's trying to rectify it. And I think that that's a, a pretty good lesson. He's faced with a stumbling block and he's trying to get over it. Will he manage? I'm not going to say. As I said, a lot of this is very, very slow. But I did think that Hector Heathcote was a likable protagonist. And the other characters we meet in this are not too bad as well. The animation style is, it's okay. There's definitely nothing wrong with it. There's nothing about it that I think was done badly. We have a pretty standard color palette for this kind of narrative. It works very well. And the character designs are fine as well. It's not my favorite style. But I certainly didn't dislike it. As my introduction to Hector Heathcote, it's definitely not a bad cartoon. I thought it was okay. I think I preferred the character of Hector Heathcote more than I did the execution of the narrative. But there was enough in there for me to think it was pretty decent. And I'm looking forward to watching more Hector Heathcote. I don't know what to expect. I will go in to the next one with an open mind and for now I am happy to recommend The Minute and a Half Man. It may not be perfect but it was enjoyable enough and I'm looking forward to watching more.